Less than a half hour ago, a ceasefire on the Gaza Strip was announced by Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. The ceasefire comes after 10 days of fighting between Israel and Hamas. Since last Monday, more than 3,700 rockets have been fired into Israel. Now hundreds have landed in Gaza, killing upwards of 200 people, mostly Palestinians. The death toll includes women and children. Israel says if Hamas continues to fire rockets, the ceasefire will be canceled immediately. Meanwhile, the humanitarian situation in Gaza continues. More than a dozen hospitals and clinics have been damaged. Medical supplies, fuel for electricity and water are running low. With the ceasefire announced, allies hope to get that delivered to the area immediately.